everybody, it's Robin. I'm here with Evil Client. We are going to do a white um, floral. So I've started this tutorial with Peacefully Me 522 by Dazzle Dry. It is a pink French manicure and um, I used a Wet n Wild Clear and I put about 15 to 20 drops of Wet n Wild White in it to get a really, really thin white color. Now, okay, so now I poured some of this out onto my palette. Boom, this is the polish, this is the paint. I'm gonna use the polish first. The polish is very, very thin. And so I'm gonna go in. Okay, and that's why I wanted to do so many layers of this and this and this and this. I wanted this white to match this white. And how that happens is I'm going to put polish here and push it in, and then it'll match, duh. <laughs> So, <laughs> so I'm just gonna go in like this. And I, okay, so now all this will make sense. <laughs> all these layers of layers of layers that barely layer. Okay, so now I have white acrylic paint. Now, hold your breath. You want your paint nice and thin, and then you outline. Make sure that your brush has a very, very thin top. Gotta make sure I'm in frame. Evil client, it's very important because I can't do both. That's why it's a little turn hard. Me over so I okay, can good. It. Thank you. Okay, so you hold your breath. And then go around the leaves and outline. tell me to hold my breath. Why was I doing it? Because it's hard not to when you're watching because it's so, uh, you have to be really still and focused. Like okay, so now I'm going to go through See how I'm not laying, I'm not, I'm not really drawing the line as much as I'm letting the brush draw the line for me on some of these. Okay, so there's that. Okay, so going across, touching in. Okay, next one. Okay, here's the butterfly. So I'm going to push and pull up, and then outline, and outline. Push, pull up, and then I'm going to Okay, with the centers, pushing, pulling up, and then dotting, pushing, pulling up. The white is so thin, you want to make sure it's thin. Anywhere that it globs or clumps, it's going to be raised. All right, here we go. Push, pull up. Finish that. Okay, I'll finish that. Let me go ahead and do the bottom part of this one. Okay, so I'm gonna take my brush and pull. We can do swirls filigree, anything you anything you can think of and anything that you want to do. 
Um, I, it, I can only hold this nail in a certain position, so I'm trying to do as much as I can from this angle. But I'm going to go and do other stuff to it. Okay, now on the pinky, I'm going to pull, fill my brush, push, pull to the, to the cuticle, and then push, pull to the cuticle, and then push from the cuticle and pull to the center. Then with a lighter touch, I'm going to pull to the cuticle. And then you can go you can go across, I mean each one of these can be individual as to how you want it to be, but as however you want. But that's how it'll go. And then I will finish that out. Okay, so now I <laughs> Okay, now I'm gonna put crystals in the middle of them. Okay, these are this is called Pixie Dust by Swarovski, and um, I think I've said it before, but I'm saying it one more time just in case. Um, it comes in a thing like this. It has no name, so I don't remember what it's called. It is half made up of crushed crystals and half made up of almost like clear. Um, clear bullion uh, microbeads so when you put top coat on them some of them go clear and then some of them keep their iridescent uh, flavor i love the parts that are chunky that keep their iridescent flavor because as you guys know i don't work with gel i only work with polish and so some of these go clear and so i have mixed reactions on if i love this or not i absolutely think it is just beautiful and if you encapsulate it into gel i think it is probably unsurpassed in its beauty. It is just beautiful. But for nail polish, I don't know if it serves a lot of purpose and is worth the $40 price tag. I, I don't know if I'd, I'd go, I'd totally go in on it with four people for $10 a piece. It's totally worth it. But it's packaged not very well either. If you notice when I scrunch it, do you hear that squeak? It doesn't click and it, I don't know if the, the lid's on all the way. That's why I put some in here. Because that way if I spill this, I know that I'm not spilling the whole bottle. Because if you guys have been doing nails a lot, you guys know that these things fall and you lose your stuff. And I'm not gonna lose $40 worth of crystals. That's not happening. So I'm gonna put some top coat down here in the center of the flower. Then I'm going to pick up with some Embella Jelly on the end of my stick and show you what it looks like. Okay. Ah, okay. Maybe if I take some of the light out. Okay, so I'm pushing it in together like this into the center of the flower and just gemming it up. Then I'm going to go right across the, the center of the butterfly. I'm, you know, you could color most of it in with crystals if you like. You can use as many or as little crystals as possible. And if you're really into these pixie crystals, then yeah, because I can see where I could almost fall in love with these, but they, there's just a few things that are irritating about them. It's like a, an okay boyfriend that treats you nicely. Because, yeah, they're, <laughs> I mean, it's nice, I like it, but I don't know if I could marry it. It's not going to be in my thing that I keep forever, you know what I mean? Do you understand, evil client? I understand. Thank you, because you're looking right at it with me. So anyways, all I'm saying is that these would be perfect for a wedding. <laughs> <laughs> and no, I'm not getting married. Evil client, you've got the nails. I don't care. Dun 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 dun. Oh my gosh, I am crazy. Let me finish this design. Okay, so here is the end result. Let me show you up close. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you try these, show me on my Instagram, Robin Moses Nail Art at Instagram, and subscribe be the first ones to see all the new designs don't those crystals you know these crystals are a love hate thing because i halfway love them and halfway are, i'm like mm, i don't know i love them right now i freaking love them so there we go <laughs> all right you guys subscribe and i'll see you back with more everybody have a great night bye, bye.